Hello everybody, welcome back. Let's play Dominus Galaxia. With me, Get Dave. I remembered. We are uh, saving up our allowance so we can build a warship. It's a big one. I'm very excited to take it into action. All right, maybe I should sneak on some ECM. All right, improving your scanning range could be helpful if we're anticipating. Nope. If we're anticipating trouble and, oh man, five destroyers. Yeah, we will be taking our new warship out for a test cruise against those guys. Oh man! Okay, so the battle wagon is like battle pods. Um, buffs up your ship, but it's clumsy. There's a lot of tempting options here. Um, we're still waiting on research. Okay, the zero people are about to yell at us. No? All right, they might be si silently building resentment and our, <laughs> our fleet's pretty terrible. We're going all in on Zortrium, everyone. Four years. They have a very decent empire out there. Oh, 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 what's this going on? Unknown destination. I think I might have an idea on what they're going for. All right, it has missile bases. Let's just double check this and you can wait before we go exploring. So close. Take out missile bases. Cool, we can uh, fill in a lot of our interior with that sweet new tech. It's not great. Yeah, fill it up. I mean, those are just going to add very tiny, modest buffs, but it, it's something, right? And it's a, it's a great ski resort. Extract tech. Personal deflector shield I'd really like. Anti-missile system I would also really like. Okay, we'll take that because there's fewer compound uh, probabilities working against us. Okay, one frigate. Okay, we got a missile base. It's something. Zortrium, all right. Yeah, we grab this for long-term planning, I think. I don't know, the ground combat buff is hard to argue with. Okay, ship design. Our tech level's gone up, construction went up so we have more space. 
Nice. There we go. Another 50 hit points on this thing. And it's still in the quality ballpark of what we originally had. Look at that. All right. And this time, we can afford it. All right, I would rather push the, de oh boy. All right, let's see if we get a good design. If you get bad rolls, it seriously underperforms, so. Oh no. Juiced. You know what? I'm not without a heart. Have one year of stimulus spending. Yeah, you can run away now. Sure, I'm sure we're all gonna die before your mighty empire. All right, handouts are over. Start repairing and making, oh, they're ultra poor. Man, this place got kicked while they were down. Equalize research. The next tech I'd like to have most is probably soil enrichment, but we'll even it out a bit now. All right, you had your chance. And the bombs. Just wait on research for lack of a better option while we wait for the engineers to finish our ship. Just advance tech level in that situation. Okay, I don't like that they're starting to get adventurous. Why don't I have Quaylar? Why don't you go up there? That's probably green territory. Also, there's something back there. This is seeming like the inner ring of the bullseye map. Huh. But we only have 50 stars. Like, this has got to be... How many do I have? 3, 6, 10, 12. Okay. It's like 16. Looks like a fleet that might be en route to Seoul. Come on, research. Blow up missile bases. Sure, I like money. You're never getting my star charts, man. You can tell you're willing to buy them. Um. I want to see what the options are before I invest in classics. Whoops, there went my phone. I've thumped a lot of things in this recording session. Hmm. All right, let's just see. Oh, they're not playing around. Proton gun, proton gun. Yeah. 
getting some kills in. So this is like about nine. No, I have no reason to stick around. Whew! All right, you got the long end of the stick. Congratulations. It's your colony. I was technically attacking you. Come on, warship. Yeah. This has been a long 10 turns. Thank you for personal detect deflector shield. Ooh. Yeah, that lowers our security. We'll see how this ends. Yeah, we're gonna throw a little bit more money at this. We do have a research treaty now, so. Trying to think about ones that would pay for themselves. Mm, nothing's really jumping out at me right now. Ooh, we got a good one. All right, this is a massive success. We got an extra neutron beam, only minus three on hit points. It's way fast. All right, and a little on the cheaper side. And I forgot to change its name and appearance again. Oh well. Okay, roll them out. Oh no, we don't need to drop any bombs. Sure. Yeah, we definitely don't need the bad bombs. Let's move up a level. I don't like that their theoretical weapons are as good as they are. All right, I'm going to try to do a better job of having a, a float of money available now. Uh, let's try relying on spies to do this. Oops. Diplomacy. Just a little bit of spying. But it's still great. Automated repair unit is the one I want. All right, well, looks like we got away with it. Oh man, Dynaper doesn't even have. All right, well, get serious. Uh, and I'll take money. Well, Zoth.
Nope. One of you is blowing up my factories. Look how fast it gets there. Take the missiles. Yeah, having 30% more firepower on our missile bases. All right, the Nergs aren't gonna like that, but so it goes. So they're not gonna like me by the end of this. Good stuff. That's all the little colonies. Five destroyers. I mean, all of this is probably equivalent to about seven destroyers, maybe. I'm going to assume our technology is more advanced than theirs, but... I want auto repair unit. That's all there is. Sweet. Cheaper factory is always good. I wish we could just tell them star charts are off limits. All right, by the time those ships arrive, Omega bombs, not to be confused with the, oh, Omega-5 bomb. There you go. Okay, ion stream projectors, terrible in small doses. You start piling them up, they really do awful things to enemy ships. Hard to say no to the fusion beam, but I'm a little... I already have the neutron blaster. Three hundred and seventy-five tons versus one seventy. Thirty five damage. Okay, and they're kind of close range. Yeah. Let's grab Stinger missiles. The important thing to remember is those are buffing out every. Sure. Every missile upgrade is going into the, your missile bases defensively. Ooh. Okay, let's grab this. Now, fertile. That's the good stuff. Can't get to that one. Okay, three turns and we send in the attack. And then I think we pick off white. Oh yeah, yeah, totally there will be, but I'm just gonna keep trying it and let's see 
how serious you really are. Cool, good work, Defense Bureau. Did they just discover a, a wormhole? Looks like. Now I have a ton of money. We could bribe them to go away, but this is a weapons test. One proton gun. We have long range because of our neutron blaster. Gotta kite that through the asteroid field. It's a fat neutron blaster. Probably shouldn't have exposed my flank to it, but They're not even getting through the class four shields. Well, that changes things. You can see the flanking bonus really helping out there. I'd say this was a very successful weapons test. Yeah, let's grab it. Oh, we're colonizing. We're going all in. Take a break for a minute and focus on that. And let's see what we have at, uh, if we can find a rich planet, that would be great. Oh man. Okay, one frigate's probably not gonna stop me if you wanna keep it. Yeah, that long range, oh, nothing. Nothing there. Zoth is in a really, really quite a hot spot. Gonna, we're gonna take <laughs> their problems a bit more seriously here. And I think it's time to design a bomber. Ugh. Unfortunately, this is worth it. All right, we almost have the battle wagon now. Cool, now improved defense space. Yeah, I mean, that doesn't have a ton of value to us, but. All right, for a bomber, could go cruiser, a sweet 1200 hit points. And room for lots of firepower. Great missile defense. 
Shields help. Any defense buff you can get. I think you can shoot at incoming missiles, which would be a big deal. I should probably confirm that. Maybe we'll go with neutron beams just to be sure. Yeah, we don't have any great Might be worth getting the temporal compressor on there. Twenty eight hundred. Actually, we're just getting a better completion ratio before. Yeah, twenty eight forty four. All right. The Gilgamesh, actually, I like that name. That looks like a bomber. And I'm less concerned that we have everything perfect on our bomber. Let me try bumping it a little bit. We've got the cash. All right, bombers uh, being researched, everyone, and then we can start getting serious about invading the galaxy. So that's a uh, that's a good thing, right? That would be a good place to also test things out. Oh man, white's almost wiped out. Actually, let's just see if we can do that ourselves. Oh, yeah, no, that's fine. <laughs> Are you sure you want to start a war, Dave? Yeah. When, when am I not? Oh. I just got automated repair unit after I started designing my bomber. Yeah, we're not even gonna bomb you. I'll take the security protocol you speak of. Wow, they were terrible. And I guess we try Oshu to see if we can make that happen. Yeah, just stop when you get there, man. Yeah, let's take command here, folks. Where are you gonna run? Oh man, they're actually just as advanced as I am. Okay, we're looking at some losses. Maybe not, it must have been some range dissipation. No, let me... 
me at him. Don't let them get away. Yeah, I'll bomb it. Maybe I should declare war first. Inferno colonization would be nice. Uh, okay. Nerg colony. Oh, okay. Well, I can't declare war, so... Okay. And we'll synchronize the invasion to happen in six turns. All right, everyone, next time we'll see how that goes. But I have a good feeling because I don't think their ground combat tech is very good. I'll see you in the next episode, and uh, yeah, invasion, good time. <laughs>